Hi and welcome back to Classic MGB and another Viewers Cars episode. This one owned by Victor Van Tress from Southern California. So let's dive straight in. Victor bought this 1965 MGB Roadster in 1970 but drove only on mountain roads as he was only 16 years old. Clearly started young. He then progressed to autocrossing and surprisingly it didn't seem to damage the car too much. This picture is from 1974. In 1989, Victor decided that the car should be returned to its original condition because the paint was thin and the leather was past its best. So he started a complete bottom-up restoration which included all the suspension and underbody, as well as the engine and transmission. Unlike most UK cars, of course, there was no rust and all the original trim was reused. Victor prides himself on not using any aftermarket parts on the car. The fuel pump and voltage regulator are genuine OEM parts, and even the turn signal relay is 57 years old. He's even retained originality by replacing the brushes on the generator that came with the car, rather than replacing it. The restoration was completed in 2005 and the car was registered for the road again, although with hindsight Victor now admits that the car didn't really need restoration. There are a couple of non-original parts though, it has a 4 synchro overdrive transmission and 15 inch wire wheels. The car's now done 145,000 miles and in Victor's words has a million memories. He says it will never be completely Concours, but it's in the same condition that he bought it in 48 years ago and he plans to wear it out all over again. If you'd like your car featured in a future Viewers Cars episode, drop us an email at hello at classicmgb.com telling us all about the car and adding a few pictures. If you've got some video then so much the better. As always, thanks for watching and I'll let Victor have the last word as he attempts to start his pride and joy. Take care. Well, there is the MG and right now what we're going to do is we're going to start it. Stone cold. Say it ain't so, right? No. It will start. It always starts. I don't know any Lucas jokes because I never have any trouble with the car. Well, let's see now. Stick the key in. I always leave the key in the ashtray, sorry. That's... All right, pull the choke all the way out. Give you a little bit of dashboardage here and 